Now listen, I don't know about you guys, but I cannot play Fortnite on a cell phone. I can barely play it on a console. I can barely play it on a PC. I just can't do it. My mind can't wrap around building and shooting at the same time. These people are out there building mansions with Wi-Fi using Fortnite. Like, I don't understand it. But I did find a little trick. It finds out on iOS 13, and I have the iPhone uh, 10R over here. On iOS 13, you can connect a controller. Now, this is kind of not fair because you're going to be up against people most likely that are not using controllers. You see where I'm getting at? Major advantage. <laughs> and uh, I think that's the only way that I can actually win a game of Fortnite. So that's kind of sad. But at the same time, hey, it might make the game fun for you because I know the few, first few times when I played Fortnite using only touchscreen controls, I almost broke my phone because I threw it against the wall. We don't need none of that here. So I'm gonna show you guys how to connect uh, any Bluetooth really controller, either a, a, an Xbox controller, a, a PS4 controller, or even like really any like controller you can probably buy at GameStop or Walmart, your local garage sale. Listen, I don't know. I don't know your living style, guys. So let's get it started. So to get this thing to work, you're obviously going to need a controller. Thumbs up for that. No, really, give me a thumbs up on this video because I'm going broke. Anyway, let's continue. Open up your Bluetooth settings on your iPhone or any iOS 13 enabled device, especially it also works on iPad, by the way. Once you got that down, put it to the side. It's not going to bite you. Don't worry. What you want to do is turn, turn it on. Wait, no. Yeah. Hold this and this at the same time. It's going to blink red twice. Or it's going to blink that. It's going to do that weird thing. You want to come back over here. Boom, DualShock 4 wireless controller. You want to click on that bad boy. It'll say connected. Now, time to kill some people on Fortnite. Now, as you guys can see, it says press Y to play. Uh, there's no Y on this controller, but you can just press triangle. And as you guys saw, it did something. Now it's uh, matchmaking, so it's working. So as you guys can see, it is definitely working. And uh, so yeah, it works. As you can see, this is uh, just, you know, like fire or to hit. Uh, build is circle or B if you're on Xbox. Nothing right now is square from what I can tell. Jump is X. And you might want to turn off notifications. <laughs> but it works. Uh, it definitely works. Just a heads up, I am still bad at this game. <laughs> the only reason I won uh, the, that one time is because I was camping the whole time. And just to show you guys aiming is this one right here. So pretty much just like Call of Duty, essentially. Yeah, I think this would definitely be better on an iPad because uh, the screen is just too small to really enjoy it fully. Oh God. What was that? Oh, it's a box. I wanna show you guys at least one kill to see how overpowering this setup is. Oh, I'm gonna die. Oh, Jesus. Oh, I died. I suck at this. But you guys get the picture. It definitely works. Everything works. Try it out. Give me a thumbs up or thumbs down if you died like I did. Wait, in fact, no. No, don't do that because I'll, I'll have a lot of thumbs down in this video. So, guys, that is pretty much it. That was Mark from Mark's Tech. And adios.